Hello everyone, Steve here, welcoming you to another Hobby Farm Guys Spotlight. Today, we turn the spotlight on the Oppenzeller Spitzhauben. Stay tuned to learn more about this fascinating chicken breed. If you're looking to add a little variety to your flock, an interesting and unique breed to consider is the Oppenzeller Spitzhauben. The breed is believed to have originated from the monasteries in northeastern Oppenzeller region of Switzerland in the 1500s. The national bird of Switzerland, it's still common there, but it is quite rare in other places. There are actually two types of Oppenzeller that hail from this region, and both are unique looking birds. The Spitzhauben, meaning pointed hood, which sports a spectacular feather crest that resembles the bonnets worn by women of the area at the time, and the Barthuner, meaning bearded head, which lacks the crest but sports a one-of-a-kind beard. Today, we'll focus on the Spitzhauben. In addition to the unique feather crest, Spitzhauben chickens display beautiful plumage, most commonly found in the silver spangled color variety, gold spangled and black Oppenzilla varieties also exist. With their black and white speckled plumage, forward thrusting crest, and a V-shaped comb and full fanning tail, they are truly eye-catching birds. Typically raised as ornamental or showbird, the Oppenzeller Spitzhauben will lay a decent number of medium-sized white eggs, and this bird excels at free-ranging. A smaller bird, roosters reach about a full-grown weight of approximately 5.5 pounds. Hens are naturally a bit smaller, weighing in at around 4 pounds when full-grown. Being smaller allows them to fly easier, and boy do they love to do so. Perhaps a bit flighty or anxious, they are active and known for flying up and roosting in trees. This is a bird that will not tolerate confinement. So if you plan on adding Spitzhaubens, either have a very large run to contain them, or plan on allowing them to free range. Hailing from the mountains of Switzerland, they have no issues with cold climates, but also tolerate heat fairly well. They do excel at free ranging, finding most of their diet as they actively patrol the yard. Not a cuddly chicken, don't plan on keeping these as snuggle pets. Also, Spitzhauben rarely go broody. Being too small for a meat bird, and with other breeds easier to manage to eggs, the Spitzhauben is not very common, especially in the U.S. The Spitzhauben gene pool in America tends to have quite a few breeding defects due to the shallow gene pool and inbreeding. Oppenzellers are not recognized in the U.S. by the American Poultry Association, although there is a push to get the breed accepted, and several dedicated breeders are working to improve the Oppenzeller stock. So is the Oppenzeller Spitzhauben right for your hobby farm? Uniquely beautiful, they do come with some challenges and definitely won't be a good fit for everyone. But if you're up to the challenge, you may find raising these rare chickens to be a rewarding endeavor. Let us know what you think of the Oppenzeller Spitzhauben chicken by leaving a comment below. And as always, remember to like the video. And if you found it interesting and useful, please subscribe if you haven't already. Until next time, happy hobby farming.